All right, so it's time to assault the villain's hideout. Fuck the Griffins. Oh, hey, I actually have to fight you, do I? Uh, I got an idea. Ow, stop that. Eat them! That's right, it will distract you from how tasty the protagonist is. Oh, that didn't last too long. It's like sending in bits of bread to take care of the ducks. That's one magazine. Oh, hey. You eat them. Come on. I just noticed these. And apparently, barrels explode when Griffins step on them. Okay. Better idea. Go hide near the barrels first. So they blow up when he charges through them. Either that or some dipshit threw a grenade over there. You know, I'm almost willing to just straight expect that the AI probably killed him. Never mind. Big fuck off, Magnum. Not land first so I can, you know, steal your soul. Fuck off. And then, you know, fire from the sky conveniently. Oh, shit, those are flaming goat turds of doom. Okay. Hold on, gonna stay away from the exploding barrels. Don't want to fight the griffin no more. Alright, I have one use for this missile. Suck it, noob! Magnum. Hey, is this thing's fucking badass enough to give a griffin pause? It's gonna be very handy soon. A little more handy than, you know, firing a rocket launcher in proximity, you know, close proximity. You guys do the head-on assault thing. I'll flank them. You know... That way, I get an attack bonus against... Oh, well, he wasn't flat-footed. Sneak attack! I'm a thief! I get bonus d6, asshole! What are you shooting at over there? Oh, you're... What the hell? Fuck off. Hang on, I gotta go eat some chicken soul. Nom nom. I don't think that's exactly what they meant by chicken soup being good for the soul. Oh, he's just hanging. I was about to say, is somebody getting paled on that? Probably one of the Ghostbusters. Probably the rookie from the new Ghostbusters game. Boom booms. Wow. Oh, here he comes. And by seal the building and eliminate the interlopers, it means set loose two minotaurs on me, which eat frame rate. Where's the other one?
Or does the other one only pop out after you cause so much damage to the first one? Oh, shit! Oh, there he is! why you want to get them both together so you can throw grenades at them. God damn, I love this gun. There's the beef. I want more ammo for the Magnum. That thing actually does damn good against fucking minotaurs. Hello, how are you? You are dead. How you survive the Molotov unless you spawned out of the fucking ether? Which, then again, that is what evil henchmen tend to do. Spawn out of the fucking ether. Oh, everyone's dead? Turn your back for two seconds. Get picking nine millimeter slugs out of your fucking ass cheeks. Oh. Oh, god damn. I am not fighting those. Go fuck yourself. Yeah, I'll just let the ninja glass absorb the bullets. This coming from the evil guy that unleashed every mythological creature in the fucking... Well, they're fucked. Every mythological creature in the fucking book on the world. Shit. Ninja glass can be broken in this, I forgot. Hi, my name is Deckard Kane, and I come on not to greet you, so sit your ass and listen or I'm gonna have to beat you. Ah, I miss that song. Yeah, great. Flaming goat turds. Sometimes oh, shh. I forgot that sometimes they explode when you kill them. Hello frame rate. What's bothering you now? The fire effects? Or are you just being a little bitch today? I'm quite happy to sit here. Thank you, plot. Fight. I just charge headlong into the flamethrower guy and have to redo all this shit. 
Well, thank you for joining the party. Wonder where the fuck you guys were the whole time. Oh yeah, hiding behind me. Because you have the life expectancy of a fucking day fly. Okay. We got lift blues again. You know, that's one of those times when a short loading screen I prefer. If we don't stop right now, it's all over. Mm -hmm. Duck, Duck Hunt, over here. What? Get me out of this cell and I can help you reach the rooftop. Uh, those lab doors are sealed. You'll have to find another way in. I'll think about it. I'd say that was worth it. Hmm, we have to find a way to save Vivian. No, it's not. You don't have any werewolf backup. Of course, I don't either, but I don't like refreshing those things. Chair. Why do the evil people always get the comfortable chairs? God damn it. Yeah, gee, thanks for the confidence, bitch. No, oh, that's this glowy. The phase moved most of this operation to the machine on the rooftop. Its power cycle has already started. Fortunately, he was too pressed for time to change the security codes. I can bypass the locks on the express lift to the roof. The lift is on the top floor of this lab and will take you straight to the machine's power regulation. You go ahead. I'll follow after I've disabled the security cameras so that they won't see you coming. Is there a reason the graphic? Yeah, the graphics on the bullets in the belt are fucked up. Apparently, I'm firing black rounds. Clubhouse is better than yours. What? Oh.
So there was a dickhead in that room with a heavy machine gun. Hey, look, my bullets aren't, well, black anymore. I got my bullet graphic back. I think I got one. Where are those other grenades at? Oh, you bitch. What the? I killed you! Set that enemy in that room. Well, and cunt locks the fucking door behind her, so I can't go back and get that other rest of that box of grenades. Fucking. And that's. And when you reload from checkpoint, the fucking animus. And there goes my. Oh, I got the dark bullets of darkness. Fuck you. Deckard, all security cameras are disabled. I'm on my way out. Get to the power control booth and wait for me there. Can I, no, can't look at anything. Gotta look at the floor. for its final absorption cycle. If we don't stop him now, every single creature on the planet will fall under his control. I can't shut the machine down from here. We have to disable the three power regulation clusters surrounding the center platform. That will shut down the shield protecting Pandora's box so you can destroy the machine. Each cluster has a control panel. If you can unlock the panel, I can overload the cluster from this control booth. Hurry, Deckard. Time's running out. Wait, was that the Oblivion symbol? Should have hired more competent staff, really. Where'd the glitch in? Be fine. Two more clusters ahead. We're almost there. Three weeks of rain, Dickon. You can kill 
Well, to be honest, you were gonna kill me, so. Ah! Anti gravity grenades or some shit. Rock out to the music, you fucking queer wolf. Yeah, now I have to overload the thing of what's it with some MacGuffinry to detonate the MacGuffin power and save the world. I don't know. The ending cutscene's playing, I don't, I don't give a fuck. Ooh, big, oh! Really? Mauled by a werewolf, thrown through ninja glass, gobcockled by a griffin, and then impaled on a big thing, to then fall off the spike, and break your back on a railing before falling into the generator core like Emperor Palpatine. Yeah, I think the villain got fucked. Deckard, Deckard, my God, how did you survive that blast? Plot armor. That I was already dead, that apparently. Box, it shattered into a million pieces. There's no way we can use it to banish the creatures now. Man. Luckily, we still got you. That signet on your arm. It's our last hope. Remember those scans we took at Council Headquarters? It turns out your signet contains encoded instructions on how to build a new box. We just need to figure out how to read those instructions. I'm sorry it came to this. We can't afford to ask nicely. Just remember, this is for the good of humanity. Uh, no, don't. Could have just said, please. Dick. That's when the council turned on Deckard. Lexington didn't even give him a chance to volunteer. They just snatched him up and threw him in a prison cell to study like a lab rat. Of course, they assumed I was killed in the destruction of Pandora's box, just like they assumed Deckard couldn't escape from their prison. Two assumptions that turned out to be quite false and would have terrible consequences for the council later on. Especially when they came to realize what the truth of Pandora's box was and how Deckard became determined to set things right. Just not in the way anyone expected. Yay, I have pet chicken tigers.
So yeah. That was legendary. It's fun. Can be a bit buggy at times. But it's fun. And I think it's actually reasonably cheap on Steam. Especially if there just happens to be a sale, then it's retardedly cheap. But yeah. I think I actually picked it up for only a couple bucks during the uh, recent summer sale. Before that, I played it on 360, and unfortunately, I rented it, so some little someone's fuck spawn had scratched the disc up, and I wasn't ever able to make it past the Kraken, because it's like, you killed the Kraken, Freeze! Then it's like, okay, let's try it again. You killed the Kraken, Freeze at the same spot. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Wow, good job for apps. Lag it up on the fucking credits. Okay, we're starting to get into the fucking... Now I just kind of realized that this whole song... Oh, well, here's the thank you, so it's almost over. I was say, this whole thing seems like a repeat of the same... Da -da 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 -da. That's all it is. The Wildlife Way Station. Okay. For lending us their werewolves, I guess. For not killing me these months. <laughs> Big Boss Almighty Miles is one of the production babies. Okay. Says, What's your name? Big Boss. What? Big Boss Almighty. <laughs> really you just trying to drag out the credits what the fuck is ambix okay good it's dead I was about to say fuck this and just cut it off so I like about the considerate games that are like do you want to watch the credits it's a credits option if you really give a fuck otherwise they don't fuck around and piss with you they just eh fuck it well, anyway, like I said, that was legendary. It's fun. It's reasonably cheap. So, yeah, you got a couple bucks here or there lying around. Give it a shot. Other than that, I'll see you next LP. Later.